So uh, there was, I think, a college festival where we had to like submit short films. So we just made like two very random, very weird videos, very weird trailers, and we just submitted them. But that experience was so great that we just sort of stuck on with it. Along that same time, like the theater club was also, uh, the dramatics club was also doing plays and they were looking to audition actors for it. We ended up auditioning and we got into play, we got into one of them. So we ended up, we went to Goa, we acted it out. I think we got like second or third place or something, I don't remember. Uh Um, But through that, we ended up like getting really deep into it. But even though it was a dramatics club where the highlight of the year is one of one doing one play uh, where you call in like a 500, 600 um, seat crowd. Uh, for me and Neeraj especially, it was we were more interested in the filmmaking aspect of it. We were more interested in like just the camera and like what you can do with it. So um, we just kept at it. Like we just kept creating more films. We just started doing more trailers, uh, more weird things. And um, we started submitting our short films to the college festival as well as like some others out there. Mm. We ended up doing pretty well and we realized that we have a knack for filmmaking that probably a lot of others don't. Mm. So that's pretty much like where I started building a little bit more. And then eventually the Dramatics Club realized that this could be a big part of like the club itself. So they ended up creating a whole like short film unit and um, Neeraj and I were one of the first like heads of that unit and to try and recruit more people to try and get more filmmaking happen uh, in the Dramatics Club. Uh, Kunal was pretty much, uh, I think Kunal maybe has a passion for acting or maybe he did before, but he was also one of those people who, who we just, we introduced him into it. He started hanging out more with us and just, it, it's one of those things where it just like clicked for him. And he decided to get into it even more. And now it reached a point where he is like doing ads and, you know, movies and all that kind of good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's so uh, like, if you think about it, the two people in the same environment are motivated by completely different things, right? Kunal probably pursued the same degree, but took a very different path because what, what really got him going was his passion for acting and, and filmmaking too, because I know he, pursued that in terms of ad filmmaking with Neeraj as well yeah. right so yeah um and yeah that's actually a good thing like we um we were I think like we in general or what I really value about my friends is that we're all really like internally motivated to mm-hmm. push ourselves and to f- do different things mm-hmm. so along with doing short films we also figured out like what more can we do with this because clearly the degree is not engaging us enough, like studying in college is not engaging us enough. So what else can we do with this? And so we ended up like finding clients to make films for, so we could make a little money out of it. We ended up making, I think maybe a couple of lakhs in college, just like going to one of these like Urupi, there was a festival in Urupi, like a religious festival that somebody wanted to shoot. So we ended up like doing two days of that. And then somebody else wanted a, a video of their remote control cars uh, <laughs> contest, some sort of racing uh, contest. So we did a lot of this stuff and we realized like, wow, we can also make money out of this. These are some of the few projects that we did where we also like skilled up. Wow. Okay. So w- do you think this was like the first like sort of entrepreneurial project you worked on or was there, were there other sort of entrepreneurial things you worked on? Because I want to jump into Jobspire after this and, you know, more focused on your your understanding of the problem that you were trying to solve there. But apart from, you know, like the the filmmaking uh, entrepreneurial venture, were there other like uh, similar experiences you had uh, with entrepreneurship? Uh, I don't think so. I think filmmaking was one of the first ones, but it was like entrepreneurial in different ways. Mm-hmm. One of the ways was what I just mentioned, which is where we try to find clients and make films for them. Sure. The other one was we would just make videos for YouTube, just like content. We had uh, this character called Dr. Howdo, mm-hmm. who would just uh, make videos about how to do a certain thing. And it would be just like five minutes of jokes, pretty much. <laughs> so we did those for a couple of episodes that I consider as an entrepreneurial thing as well, because there was nothing really like driving us to do it, other than the fact that we wanted to really challenge ourselves and maybe even consider making a business out of creating content for YouTube. So. Yeah. That's where it started. Yeah, that's where the entrepreneurial journey 
started. 